Hey everybody, welcome back to Type 1 Diabetic Warriors. My name is Jim. Today we're going to talk about a fast track designation from the Food and Drug Administration. It can be for any disease. Uh, it has got an acronym called RMAT, RMAT, we'll call it. And basically, what that does is it speeds up the entire clinical uh, evaluation process, clinical trials, and all that. And it's a designation that is given out to companies that have promising technology. Now, in this case, we care about the technology that is looking for a cure for type 1 diabetes. We are following a company that is working on that, and they just recently got this designation. So we're going to put the whole story together for you. We're going to do it in two pieces so it isn't overly complicated. We'll talk about the designation from the FDA and this particular company. And that'll be the first of two videos. So I think you're going to find this very interesting, very promising. The FDA thinks it's pretty good. So if you would hit the like and subscribe button, that always helps us to reach more people with very valuable information on this subject of type 1 diabetes and hopefully finding a cure here one day soon. So let's get to it right now. RMAT and that designation from the FDA. Regenerative Medicine Advanced Therapy, RMAT. What does this FDA designation mean for type 1 diabetics? The Regenerative Medicine Advanced Therapy, RMAT designation is a special status granted by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration, FDA, to regenerative medicine therapies that show promising clinical evidence. This designation was established under the 21st Century Cures Act, passed in 2016, to accelerate the development and approval of therapies in the field of regenerative medicine, which includes treatments like gene therapy, cell therapy, and tissue engineering. Here's what makes RMAT designation significant. Faster approval pathways. Therapies receiving RMAT designation can take advantage of expedited FDA programs, such as priority review and accelerated approval, similar to those given to drugs targeting serious conditions. Increased guidance and support. Companies developing RMAT designated therapies receive more intensive guidance from the FDA on clinical trial design and other aspects of development ensuring that they can meet regulatory requirements effectively and more efficiently. Eligibility criteria. The therapy must treat serious or life-threatening conditions. It should be based on regenerative medicine technologies, such as cell therapies, gene therapies, tissue engineering, etc. Preliminary clinical evidence must show that the therapy has the potential to address unmet medical needs. RMAT designation is highly valuable for companies working in cutting-edge therapeutic areas because it facilitates a smoother and faster pathway to approval, allowing potentially life-saving therapies to reach patients more quickly. Okay, then who is Throne Biotherapeutics, and how does this affect the search for a cure for type 1 diabetes? Throne Biotechnologies is one of the leading biotech companies aiming to find a cure for type 1 diabetes. According to a recent press release from Throne Biotherapeutics, quote, Throne received FDA approval on regenerative medicine advanced therapy RMAT designation by using stem cell educator therapy to treat type 1 diabetes. The viewers of this channel need to grasp this important distinction. The FDA approval in this instance refers to the fact that preliminary data has shown there's sufficient evidence that this process of re-education of the cells in the patient's body warrants further study on an expedited basis. This does not mean the Food and Drug Administration has approved this as a final therapy to cure type 1 diabetes. It simply means that this technological process looks very promising to the point that the FDA has granted this RMAT or Regenerative Medicine Advanced Therapy designation to speed up the process of clinical trials with the final results ultimately presented to the FDA for review and hopefully total approval as a treatment or cure for type 1 diabetes. Because this FDA designation is a story by itself, we at Type 1 Diabetic Warriors decided to break down this technology known as Stem Cell Educator Therapy in a different video to follow this one. We try not to overwhelm our audience with too much information in one video. Does that make sense, Jim? Stem cell educator therapy. Okay, thank you for that explanation, Carl. I thought you did a great job on that. Now, when we 
explore that therapy in an upcoming video in a few days, you will see why this fast track uh, RMAT designation from the FDA makes a lot of sense. Uh, the two of them together make the whole story. We'll break it down in part two in just a few days. So thank you for being here today and stay well. We'll have another video for you in a very short time. Be well and have a great day.